Building a one-to-one -one is always advantageous because you're able to sit on the boat and feel where everything goes and uh, having Harkin come down and uh, put the gear everywhere and actually have ropes to pull on has given us a, a heads up on how it's going to feel when we're on the water. And one of my mottos the whole time has been that it's very easy to sail a double-handed boat uh, crewed, but not easy to sail a crewed boat double-handed. So basically what you've got when you purchase one of these boats is the opportunity to sail with friends on the weekend or a twilight for example, but then have a serious campaign short-handed offshore. IRC have been our focus and single digit uh, rating um, events, so IRC is also a focus and of course we have the performance handicap which we're looking at as well. Um, against the one design, the one design is based on the fact that we're going to have multi boats and we're only going to get multi boats if we're a successful boat, it's a catch 22 situation. So we want a boat that performs in handicap uh, and sails to its rating, but we also want a boat that eventually attracts uh, the one design owner. The main thing is you can't take the boat. Yeah. <laughs> so, so we're really pushing to get the first boat here for, uh, for March in uh, 2021 in Sydney. Uh, the second boat has been sold and is going to Canada. So we're, we're starting the global approach. Excellent. Thanks, Brett. Cheers.